the only friend who I'm love. I don't want no bubble. Give him both of them and then I run to it. Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of Fish King from Jamaica. Welcome to my channel. Now today, I am sharing to you the fact that I am doing some work on my pond. What is happening is that I am having some issues with some insects, right? some creatures, right? some of the things and I hope to share that with you in a bit. Now, what happened is that at night, I have some tadpoles that actually comes out and goes into my pond when i say tadpoles i mean like a group of like about 50 60 of them right and they will go into my pond and if there are any flies or any small fish in it they will consume it so i've come up with a plan i have moved all my live bearers inside and i do have some uh convict cichlid flies in my ponds but i find that the tadpoles find it difficult to get these because at night the convict cichlids actually stay in the mud, in the dirt. So the, the toads or the tadpoles would have to dive very deeply, search for them to come up back and that might take a little bit and they might not really you know, enjoy that feature. Right? So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be uh, taking out all of my convict flies and I'm going to be placing them in two containers up there and I have about 60 uh, Jack them in this pond. I'm going to be taking them out and I'm going to be placing them in probably about groups of five in each pond going down the line. And hopefully, they will go quicker than if they are bundled in a small container. I, I had intended to place them in uh, a new IBC tote, but I placed my I placed my Oscars in it instead because I've also found that these tadpoles have been roaming around that one. Uh, from a place my Oscar in the large IBC tote I realized that I have not seen any and I have not fed it and it looks really fat right so I guess you might understand what happened right it is actually feeding all right so that's it I'll keep you up to date stay tuned bye bye 